My name is Jim Wilmot and I work at Siemens as the product manager for our somatic controllers. I'm going to spend a few minutes today showing you this demo you see behind me. What we're seeing here is a simulated bottling line demonstrating component-based automation and how it can be used to simplify machine-to-machine -machine communications. We have two sections here. We have a bottling section and we have a packaging section. Each of these two machine sections performs its own individual functionality and obviously contains its own controller hardware. But somehow, there has to be a communication between these two sections so that it can operate as a single integrated automation system. Today we're going to take a closer look at how this communication is done. And first of all, notice that there are absolutely no wires or cables between these two machine sections. This is done 100% using wireless Ethernet connection using these Siemens Scalance wireless access points you see on the panels. To make this hardware solution even cleaner, the controllers we're using actually have an industrial enhanced version of Ethernet called Profinet built directly on board the controller. What this does is it eliminates the additional communication card you would normally use to do this communication. So the hardware design is very clean, but more importantly, we're using component-based automation to do this interface. And what that means is that there's no programming required within these controllers to make the interface. Instead, we're going to simply configure this interface using a simple graphical program called Somatic IMAP. To do this, first we import the graphical components representing each machine section into IMAP. For example, the component bottling has two Boolean inputs and one Boolean output. The inputs and outputs can be of data types Boolean, integer, real, or even arrays. These components were automatically generated in Somatic Step 7 based on data blocks of communication I.O. stored within the controllers. After importing the components, the desired connections are made within the IMAP software. After saving the file, it's then downloaded directly to each PLC via the Ethernet connection and the communication is running. But what happens in the future when we add an additional section to this line? This is actually where you truly realize the benefits of component-based automation. To add this new section, we simply open the existing graphical IMAP program once again, add the new component section, then reroute the connections as needed. No need to reprogram all of the individual controllers as was required in the past. After a quick download of the configuration, the machine is back up and running again. Siemens offers a huge range of controllers with the Profinet interface built on board that work ideally with these type applications. To look a little closer at the demo we've got behind me, the bottling section is using one of our machine mountable washdown CPUs, the ET200 Pro. This CPU matches an entire line of distributed I.O., like you see here, Scalance wireless access points, switches, and even motor starters and variable frequency drives, not shown here, with the same washdown rating. The middle section here for labeling uses one of our standard S7300 CPUs to do the control, whereas the packaging section uses the exact same controller, only it's in a fail-safe version. So what this means is that it's certified to work with safety circuits, similar to the e-stop function you see here. And what this does is it eliminates an entire hardwired relay cabinet for the e-stop functionality, which we normally would have to have. We also offer controllers in the very compact ET200S line that match this form factor, and of course in our larger controller line, the S7400. But component-based automation also works with third-party controllers. It doesn't have to be Siemens. The only requirement is that that controller's information has to somehow get onto Profinet using a type of proxy. In summary, component-based automation is just another example of how Siemens' totally integrated automation provides the core intelligence through our entire product range to help you save engineering time and money on all your automation projects. For more information on these type solutions, please see www.siemens.com forward slash Profinet CBA or www.sea.siemens.com 
forward slash TIA controllers.